In this video, we're going to go over a table in Power BI. To add a table, you're going to go over to the visualizations section and find table. And your table will show up in your report. And to add items to that table, you need to choose from your fields. So you have two, two options to add it. fields. You can drag them over or you can click them however you want. So I'll click a few over and then a, f a few other things to note, or you can expand your table by pulling it out. And then you can reorganize your columns by dragging and dropping them. So let's say I wanted to pull product category name over. I could pull that up and let's say I wanted to switch order quantity and line total. I could switch those two columns. Now let's look at formatting our table a little bit. So first we, let's go over column headers. So you can change the color and the background color of your column header. So let's, you can make your column background color darker and and make your font white to format it that way. So we'll take that off, revert to default to take off your formatting. And for values, you can have same thing, font color. You can change the font color if you want. And also they have alternate alternating font color so and you can alternate your background color so we'll just revert everything back to default and next you have Field formatting. Again, you can change the font color by individual field. So there I changed product category name. And let me change the background color on order quantity. That doesn't look good, so we're gonna take that off. And you can apply these to headers. So let's say we change the format color of order quality. Let's make that a little bit brighter. And you can apply that to the header also. And apply that to the total. So we can refer everything to default at the bottom also. And also for the grid, we can have the vertical grid lines show up in the report and to make that a little bit more visible, just add black. So now you can see the columns vertically and same thing for horizontal. We can add those grid lines there. And you can change your thickness to make it a little bit thicker. And also change the outline weight, which is the top. The top uh, column, the top row line and the bottom row line before the total. So we refer everything back to default and Instead of doing all these individually, you can apply a style. So let's look at some of the styles that they have here. We have minimal, which would just take off most of the styling. And we have a bold header, which would just um, make the header stick out from the rest of the, the rows. And alternating row colors. And then we have some more fancy styling 
and flashy rose and so you don't have to go in there and, and um apply all the styling yourself you can just use one of the default styles they have here and also you can change your width and height manually but it's easier to drag and drop so you'll see that I changed the height by dragging so that's a little bit easier than coming in here and, and formatting that way and so other things we have is titles so we could add a title here and call this um, sales report and change the font color and you change the alignment and we can also increase the size of the header and we were back to default and we'll close this box and background we could take that off or on and change the color around the chart and then you have border and other things you could play around with so that's the basics for a chart and also one more important thing is just the tooltip See, if you turn the tooltip on when you hover over items, it'll show. Before, if you hover over, it's not going to really show that much detail. All right, so that was the basics for a table in Power BI.